that's all about like drunk stories. I don't really, a lot of these drunk stories, they felt good when I did them, but I regret like getting really blackout drunk a lot. Like you guys could see in my college party video, I was talking about my drinking stuff, but being blackout drunk isn't really fun, man. Like it, what it does, because I was like addicted to feeling good at school and all that shit. I would drink the blackout. I would bring beer bongs at the parties and fucking drink a shitload of alcohol from beer to like hard liquor, not giving a fuck. And I would just keep drinking because I was escaping from something, from the suffering shit. And I would like pass out at random people's yards and shit. Like one time I was at a party one time and. I was talking to this sorority girl. She was good looking, you know, and that's all I remembered, man, because I drank so much jungle juice and I blacked out. I didn't know how I fucking went. It was nowhere near the party. I blacked out and I passed out in someone's backyard, sleeping on a tree. And fucking, I woke up. There was a fucking, there's a bus stop where I could go to my, like, my, uh, my apartment or something like campus apartment and I was I went up there and I threw up on the mulch and I just passed out I didn't want to fucking go to class you know what I mean I was too fucked up well get blackout drunk man it isn't fun because it can get you in trouble I got in a lot of trouble doing that man fucking blackout drinking like I would get I was in a probation where I was at a party, I had a good time just talking to random people from my school or people that were just visiting, partying or something. And I somehow went in the dorm, I followed the kids for some reason. So I needed to, I, I was too fucked up to go home, you know? And guess what? I fucking passed out in the door, threw up everywhere, and fucking like, um, I got a probation. And I was supposed to do like community service and all that shit, man. It wasn't worth it, man. I then there was this one, the one time I was, I had made a video on this where I like got fucked up at a college party with a beer bong. I kept drinking beer. I kept going to keg, filling up my beer bong. Fucking, I filled up my beer bong with uh, Captain Morgan all the way to the top, you know, and fucking like, um. I just kept drinking, I didn't give a fuck, and I, I fucking started browning out, and like the, the last thing I, I, I think the last thing I remember was some girl gave me a hand job on the dance floor, or some shit, and then after that, I fucking woke up in a hospital, I woke up, I woke up in a hospital, passed out with like tubes on, tubes on me. I think I had like alcohol poisoning and um, it was a hefty bill, man. And I, I asked like one of the kids that were in the frat because I knew that kid from my high school. I was like, what happened? He's like, oh, you threw a bottle at the window and like you were angry or something. I didn't, I didn't even remember being angry. I thought I had a good time. I felt happy as shit. And then I, I noticed I rolled my ankle and it was fucked up. The, the, frat the fraternity people at the frat stole my fucking sweatshirt and fucking like um i forget what else they stole they didn't steal like money or nothing but they stole things that were like my jerk my nba jersey too it was like a gary payton sonics they stole that too and i felt bad but i like i like paid them i like paid my friend um my person from my high school a little bit of money from what happened. <laughs> they wanted me to fix the window and all that shit. I fucking didn't have no money, so I kept drinking. I kept drinking all the time, you know? But, yeah, that wasn't worth it, man. I got in trouble. I have a, I had a, un, that's how I got my underage drinking. I was 20 or 19 or something, and a lot of hefty bills, man. I couldn't drive for like six months or some shit, and it's horrible, you know. Had some funny blackout times drinking, but it was being blackout drunk isn't worth it, man. It gets you in trouble, you know. 
I used to steal alcohol from like college parties and I used to fucking like steal alcohol at my dad's house too. That like I never I never was an alcoholic. I just had like it was it was just a college culture, man, and I kind of like liked the atmosphere. I always wanted to party and shit, even though I wanted to get a good job and stuff, which was the point too. Is just I like the party and shit, and I don't work. I don't regret it because. I regret blackout drinking, but I, I don't regret, like, the social life, really. That was fun to me. But being blackout drunk isn't fun, man. It just makes you spend all your money. And if you get if you keep doing it, you can become an alcoholic. And luckily, I was never really an alcoholic. It's mostly alcoholism I was dealing with. Because I was drinking like that, um... Even when I wasn't in school, too, I was drinking, like, with my friends and stuff. I would get too fucking wasted and shit like that. But I was just addicted to alcohol. So I fucking loved, I loved, like, uh, how it made me social more and fucking, like, I, I was, like, the more I drank, I, I got more depressed. And I just wanted to chase that hedonistic, like, lifestyle, like, feeling good. You know what I mean? That's why I didn't like fucking... That's why I don't drink the blackout anymore. I, I drank once in a while. But the hangovers are crazy and it's just nuts. I just hate feeling hungover now. It's just... I just did not care. Like, I still don't kind of care, kind of, but I, I can't, like, drink, like, heavily like that. Like, 12 beers or something. And I just feel too fuck, fucking shitty hangover like a four beer hangover is all right to me but it's not worth a man drinking like that just your money's gone and all that shit you know and you get in trouble you do things that you you, you, would, you regret you know like me breaking a window at that fraternity house and um like, I would be fucking in trouble all the time. Like, it wasn't worth it. Like, one time I used to... I almost got a DUI one time. But they, they didn't do that to me. So I was smoking weed. They called me with weed, though. Yeah, it was not worth it, man. It's not worth fucking blackout drinking. Like, drinking to get buzzed and stuff is okay. But don't do it to blackout, man. I blacked out so many fucking times. Like, I blacked out to where I don't, I still don't remember what happened. <laughs> like, those times I drank, man. It wasn't worth it. Like, seriously. Like, I drank from, like, rum, whiskey, to vodka, and all that shit. Yeah, just I, I just don't recommend blackout drinking, guys. It just just gets you in trouble and more suffering and do things that you regret most of the time. I'll catch you guys with another video, though.